Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Corridor by SP2G50000. I think I said the number zeros correctly, right? 50,000? Anyway, Corridor. We have been trying to come up with some tests to solve, but since one of our chamber designers, S30G, came up with a test with a corridor design... Period. He has been struggling to make this map after not making one for a while. Anyways, test subject, I hope you enjoy. Also, the main reason why I made this puzzle was to refresh my memory. I tried to make this chamber using no unreal aspects. I would give you a high five for playing this map if I could. Important notice! I am aware that this map is broken. If you are playing, I would like you to report them in the comments below or on YouTube. I am thinking about using this puzzle for Underrun Part 3. Please use spoiler tags. Uh, what? This map is broken, but you want us to report what parts of it are broken, even though you know it's broken? I'm a bit confused, to say the least. <laughs> um... Okay. Well, if I see any Unreal aspects in the map, then I'll let you know. Alright. We have a cube that only auto-responds. Gotcha. And like a moron, I just fizzle it. Wait, is this button go to that? WHY IS IT SO FAR AWAY?! That's a seriously far away button from that dropper to not have signage. That- that really needs signage. Like, I know it- I know it has cube signage above it, but that doesn't count. Like, it could go into any dropper anywhere with that kind of signage. Also, what does this even do? Oh, it does that over there. Okay, I see now. There's also a hole in the wall there. Alright, well, it seems like the only place I can go right now. Unless I can see a portal surface in here. Nope. This does... something I can't see. And this does... that. Oh, I can get the cube in here, but... Yeah, I can- so that is something I can do, but... For now, let's just go here. Because once I go in here, I shouldn't be able to get back without using this. And even then... If I place both my portals... Oh no! I can't go back in there now. <laughs> I can grab the cube. Maybe. Yeah, I can grab the cube, so that's at least a thing I can do. It would seem like I would need to grab the cube. Hmm... That's moon. That's... that's moon. Okay, that's what that button did. So, I'm assuming this is not on a timer, right? That's permanent. Okay, I'm not clear on the concept of why that was permanent, but... okay. Hmm... Wait, what? Oh, this was only... This is only at an angle, just so that I couldn't see it from this side? But I could see that! What was the point of this? I don't- I'm- I'm not clear on the concept. I don't understand why that's different. Or why it needed to be. That's new. Do I really- Do I really have to do what I think I have to do? Surely not. Surely no respectable map maker would ever require this in a map, ever. Apparently, that's what I do. If I hadn't put that cube close enough, I wouldn't have been able to grab it without killing myself, and I would have had no way back, I guess. So that's... that's probably one of the broken things that they were talking about. I may have already broken it in other ways that I don't yet realize. How do I actually get in here, though? Also, I couldn't I get trapped in here? Like, let's- let's- let's 
do an experiment here, a thought experiment. Let's say... that's theoretically... I place both portals in here. Okay, maybe the light strips prevent it, but... In that case, all I have to do is try the other way. Okay, so I've done that now. Oh, I can still get out through that. Okay. Gotcha. Right, so I'm up here, right? And... I can do that. I think that's the only thing I can do, really. Ooh! <laughs> Let's not have a repeat of that incident. Right, so... I don't understand what changed, really. I still don't see how to get in here. Maybe I should do... this thing that I could've done from the beginning. Let's do that. How does that help me? Also, you might hear the rain outside. It's actually raining quite heavily right now. Don't know if you can hear it or not. I almost jumped over it, but not really. Oh, no. Oops. Uh... Now what? Um... Well... Okay, there's like a teeny tiny one frame window here. Do I have a slower? No, that's 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 faster. Um Try that. Nope, even that is too fast. Nope, I gotta wait a bit longer than that. Cause if I can't make this shot, I'm basically trapped. Wait till the next cycle. Come on, I totally should have made that. Also, I'm using the wrong portal here. What is going on? I should totally be able to make that. Why are all the sparks there for? I actually think I'm just literally trapped here. Oh, the game does not like the engine going this slowly. We'll see here, if I can actually make this work or not. Maybe... Nope, it, it, it actually has a delay on firing the portal gun that I was never aware of. That's interesting. What if I crouch? Oh, you can actually see it on the next time you enter the loop. Huh. But yeah, I'm, cr I'm supposedly crouching right now. It looks like my bendy's crouching. Oh, that was a mistake. Nope, zoom out. Oh, <laughs> that's a weird illusion! Nope, uh, the delay was too great. Let's try that again. <laughs> nope. I think I'm literally just trapped right now.
Alright, well. Let's just undo what I did, right? So I had a portal like that. And I had a portal like that, I think. Something like that. Right, let's pretend that I had it like that. So now, that I'm not trapped anymore, let's try it this way. Here we go, now I can make progress without being trapped. Wait, that's a timer? Are you kidding me? Why does it have to be on a timer? That was it? Okay, what is this area for? Is this if I forgot the cube? You know this is an easy way to trap people, right? You- you should probably make the return path a bit different. Alright, well. <laughs> anyway, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!